I've been with Trico for two years. And when I came to Trico, the piece that attracted to me the most, and not just the job, was the fact that it always puts community first. We're one of those unique places that truly believes if you put the community first, you'll be successful. It's not about being successful and then putting the community first. So Trico's culture, where it really stems back from is from the true family of Wayne and Eleanor when they first started Trico. And they had the saying called doing well by doing good. Wayne and Eleanor are not shy to help different organizations that are struggling. And some organizations that we did work with early on was Kids Cancer Care. We worked with Global Fest. And then most recently, we worked with WINS, Women in Need Society. So we are an organization that helps women and their families locally in Calgary, whether they are fleeing domestic violence, living in crisis, or just in a battle against poverty. We are a charity that runs social enterprise, so we do have a business side of our organization, but then we have that community side that's all about helping people in our community. The first step that we take care of is our basic needs. Um, women can't think about pulling themselves forward when they're worried about feeding their families. The second step is navigating the system of care in Calgary. The third step we use to help women to move forward is we teach them the confidence and the skills to go out and secure employment in the retail and warehousing industry. We do that in a safe, controlled environment, which is our WIN social enterprise. They spend time in the classroom learning, then they spend time on our sales floor or in our donation center, actually learning the skills, practicing the skills they learned in the classroom. I came here on September 8th, 2019. I came here uh, to be more dependent and be able to help my parents also. My friend told me that it's a program that you go learn how to write a resume or uh, how to uh, do the sales associate job. We learned uh, how to work with cash, customer service, uh, merchandising, inventory, all of these stuff and also how to look for a job, where to apply for it and also the most important thing, uh, how to get ready for interviews, how to get dressed for it. Yeah, it was really yeah helpful. We were moving out of our old office on 11th Ave and we were moving into the office space that we are in right now. And we were able to give them a downtown space and give them a little bit of a bigger presence in downtown. Wayne and I had a phone call and he said he had some space and would I want to come down and take a look and see how that space might fit for winds or what we might do with it. So I came through and as soon as I entered at that time, what was the showroom, I already had a concept in mind for what this space could be and what it could mean. For WINS, what it really meant, it would be the first time our organization could really showcase what our business model was, because it would have our store front and center in a very busy area of the city with that program center attached. Uh, we had over uh, close to 30,000 square feet of, of space. They've completely redesigned it to a beautiful storefront that they're now able to take donations and they're able to now just put everything all in one storefront and that provides a stronger presence for them on, in the downtown corner right there. It would have been very easy to knock it down, turning into revenue-based parking. Instead, it was kind of Wayne stopping and saying, hey, I know there's a, there's a group in the community that has a need, we have a space, let's connect those together. To feel this impact firsthand of this gift from Trico to help us as an organization to move forward and to do the work that's needed in the Calgary communities directly, it's overwhelming when I think about it. It, it moves me beyond words to think of the generosity and the support and the help that this gives to Calgarians. It gave me opportunity to be independent here while being a refugee claimant was always there for me and like helped me to get through my problems and uh, always had, has great uh, opportunities for me. I'm really grateful for everyone who put their endeavor to make this great program. This is something that great communities need to thrive and prosper 
And so uh, for a company like Trico, it's the ability to actually focus on a community need and saying, you know, we want to ensure that that takes place. And, you know, everything that we're in part, part of as an organization uh, on the, you know, I guess you say the community giving side or the philanthropy side is really focused on a community need. Um, it's not necessarily focused on trying to get the best name recognition for Trico. It's looking at the community and saying, you know, what can we do to make a difference? If we can empower them to do even more great work, then, then it's almost like a no-brainer.